so in this video now we are going to learn how to use that list with dictionary or list inside this inside dictionary how we can use that list so already we know that dictionary we already learned that we use that key and value pair for this and now we can try to understand how we can pass that uh, in the value how we can pass that list with that in dictionary so now i will move it and i will try to do that so first i will define one simple dictionary so if i can put that value as k now if i can put one comma k1 i can store value as 2 and then we can run this one and if i try to print that d so we have value and uh, key and value both is now displaying and if we can put that d dot t sorry my bad it's been a mistake d dot t Okay, still I'm getting no error. So it's not key, it's going to be keys. Yeah, so now we got that uh, dictionary dot keys. So we can see that now we have two uh, key value k and k one. So now similarly, if I put that d dot items. Then we'll get that all those. Uh, value associated with each and every one key and value. So now I will go ahead and try to define that one more dictionary, and I will use that G and then I can put that as the list one, two, three, and if I can use that H. Now I have defined that one key as a G, and then value with one, two, three, and other key as H and value as eight. So now if I try to execute it, it's working fine. So now if I put that D one dot H, okay. So now we got that G and H. It's still same, but now I can go ahead and try to put that items also. We can see that what we going to get. So we are getting everything in the same way. Only difference that if it's in the list, it's going to store like this. But now, how I can retrieve each list item? So as we know, so D one, and then if we put that inside that bracket of G, I will get that one two three. So now D one, and then bracket of G, and already we learn in. Already we learned that how to retrieve that list. Now if I put that zero, we'll get that one. If I put that same thing here with two, we'll get that some three. In the same similar fashion, we can get it. And now if I wanted to define two dictionary inside this, I can go ahead and put that D two. Then I can go ahead and put that. Okay. So now we have two value, and now if I go ahead and try to print that D two of value of H. Okay. Now displaying like this. So now if we can go ahead and try to print that in the same way. How we are done for the first one? Now, if I can put that up zero, so this this will display that first. So as usual, how that list going to work? It's going to start with for each of those list value start with zero, and then it will go to till that point. What uh, how much we have? So now, if I go ahead and put that, and suppose if I put that here two, then we can run that. So we are going to get that two. So in the similar fashion. We can retrieve all those values. So list inside dictionary, and we can get all those values. So I hope you like this video. Thank you.